Hey friends, in this video, we will learn about the McAfee uh, data loss prevention installation through the McAfee Envision Cloud. So I have just logged in with my McAfee Envision Cloud dashboard and uh, I can see there are the two machines which is installed and which is managed by this McAfee Envision Cloud dashboard. So I will install the product on this machine. Uh, like McAfee uh, data loss prevention. So for that, I am just going to create a new subgroup and in this subgroup, I will move this machine and uh, I'm assigning the name over here, DLP data, data USB blocking, just assigning the USB underscore B-L-O-C-K-I-N-G blocking, this blocking systems. This is the uh, subgroup names and uh, it is just uh, specifying that all the machines which will come inside this group USB will be blocked. So I have just assigned the name so it will just easier for us to identify the machines over here. So I have just created this uh, subgroup inside the my, my organizations uh, group and this is the root group, uh, root uh, uh, system root tree and uh, I just selected this machine and moving this machine inside the USB blocking systems. And uh, in this subgroup, I have just click on the OK. And uh, in the subgroup, I can see now machine has been moved over here, what exactly we wanted. Now, uh, in the McAfee Envision Cloud, you can just deploy the product by selecting the subgroups over here. And you need to click on the Deploy tab and in the deploy tab i am going to select the product which i want to deploy on this machine and these three products has already deployed on my machine so i am not going to select this one and uh, i will select only this one now i'm just unchecking these all things and uh, because product is already deployed so uh, I have uh, I'm checking this all or if you want to deploy this again so just you need to select this all and uh, you need to put the check on the save changes uh, I have just click on the save changes now because I'm going to deploy the McAfee data loss prevention on my Windows machine. So I had just selected Windows type over here. Even you can download the installer on the client mach uh, machine and uh, you can install it manually. But because I have just selected this uh, uh, this product through the, uh, you, through the subgroups and the deploy options. So now I need to just run the wake up agent on my machine where we wanted to install it. So because this machine exists inside this USB underscore blocking systems subgroup, so I need to just click on the wake up agents. And uh, once I will click on the wake up agents, now it will ask for the number of attempts, retry, interval, cancel. After these all options, you need to just uh, check uh, carefully before proceeding. Now I'm going to click on OK. Once I click on the OK and uh, I will just go on the system tree icon and I will select the McAfee agent and will uh, click on the update security over here. So once I will click on the update security, so it will just download the product and all. And uh, I need to wait for a while. Currently I can see only these options are visible, McAfee endpoint security is there. Once McAfee data loss prevention will be installed, so this will prompt it over here as well. Now uh, I will just go on the McAfee agent icon and I will just click on the McAfee agent status monitor and uh, I can see the product which is going to be selected is also visible over here, like uh, downloading DLP agent installer. It means 
uh, systems are just receiving the products from the McAfee and Vision Cloud and uh, it is just installing so it will take some time to install the uh, McAfee data loss prevention and uh, now agent finish enforcing policy and collecting properties and all these all are the activity related with the McAfee agent and because agent service is running so it will communicate uh, as per the scheduled interval for uh, fetching the information from McAfee uh, MVision cloud and uh, I need to just verify that either product has been installed and uh, I cannot see the product because still it is just applying even I need to go on the program files like uh, appvis dot cpl command and I can verify the product has been installed in the program list currently I can see this three pro four product has been installed now now it should be available over here I cannot see so need to wait and we need to reboot the machine for the product deployment and uh, I'm just rebooting this machine and uh, we'll see how products are coming over here I'm just restarting the machine system has been rebooted now I'm just logging with my credential over here Uh, now I need to see the things how product has been installed on this machine and uh, still product has not been installed I need to wait for a while I'm just going to click on the endpoint security and uh, now I can see the product has been deployed over here I'm just clicking on the view security status see McAfee DLP endpoint has been deployed on this machine successfully so in the next video we will see how we can configure the data loss prevention uh, like uh, uh, blocking USB mass storage for the client machines and uh, other settings for the uh, data loss prevention. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you.